On the 5th of January 2022, exactly 100 years after Sir Ernest Shackleton's death, we launched the Shackleton Medal for the protection of the polar regions at the Royal Geographical Society. The world has witnessed yet another year of record-breaking climate change. Unprecedented heat waves both in the Arctic and Antarctic, more wildfires than ever, crop failure on a catastrophic scale. It was a reminder of the enormity of the task that remains. Polar warming has catastrophic consequences for the rest of the globe. Today, we're launching the 2023 Shackleton Medal, and we're asking you to nominate the people that you really believe are striving to the utmost to protect the polar regions for future generations. We believe that if Sir Ernest Shackleton was alive right now, he would be leading the fight to protect the polar regions. We know there's some incredible people around the world doing just that. Oceanographers, marine biologists, glaciologists, and explorers, all working incredibly hard in the fight to save the polar regions. Battling against the odds was what Shackleton did. And today we're launching the 2023 medal here at Dulwich College, Shackleton's old school. But we're next to the James Caird, the actual lifeboat that Shackleton and his men sailed from Elephant Island to South Georgia in order to rescue his men stranded in Antarctica. This 23 foot lifeboat has become a symbol of the qualities that we want to recognize with the Shackleton medal. Courage determination, ingenuity, and leadership. In 2022, the judges decided that the very first Shackleton Medal should be awarded to Dr. Heidi Sylvestre, the inspirational French glaciologist, the person who most embodied these Shackleton qualities. For the 2023 medal, once more we brought together an expert, dedicated panel of really fantastic judges. And this year, the judging panel is joined by Dan Sloan, fresh from his expedition to discover the endurance 3,000 meters underneath the Southern Ocean. Nominations will open on the 5th of January and close on the 1st of March. The winner will receive 10,000 pounds to help them further their work. We'll announce the shortlist on the 20th of March and the winner will be announced on the 5th of April. So, who do you think should get the recognition they deserve? Who should win the 2023 Shackleton Medal for the protection of the polar regions? Make your nomination at our website, shackleton.com. By endurance, we conquer.